minutes till showtime. It's time for an intermission. And there's time before the next show begins to take your family to our concession stand. You'll find fresh hot popcorn, delicious candy bars, whatever your family desires. And you'll find the greatest treat of all, knee-high beverages. Yes, golden knee-high orange is the quality refreshment beverage that comes in quantity size. Everyone in the family will enjoy the true fruit flavor of knee-high orange. It's the beverage that meets all of your refreshment desires. Perfect for flavor, perfect for enjoyment. Treat yourself to the biggest treat of all, knee-high orange. Mm -hmm. And an extra attraction, this theater also serves quality famous Royal Crown Cola, the cola that's best by taste test. For real enjoyment, visit our concession stand and ask for Royal Crown. It's four minutes till showtime. See these two well, portable radios? Buzzers. Well, watch this. Let her go, Betsy. Sorry, friend. You old-style portables have to go. But look at our new RCA Victor portable radio. Came through without a chip. Here's the world's first and only portable radio in the non-breakable impact case. So rugged, it's the only radio case with a five-year guarantee against chipping, cracking, or breaking in normal use. Of course, a tube might jar loose, but that's easily fixed. The important thing is RCA Victor's non-breakable impact case means no chipping, no cracking, no breaking. And hear that tone. It's RCA Victor's great golden throat sound. See the world's only portables with a non-breakable impact case as low as $27.95 at your RCA Victor See dealer. What I have for you. It's three minutes till showtime. Clothing values are high. high. And the prices are low. No. That's why at Robert Hall, Robert Hall. you save on family clothes. No. Rest easy. Knowing that Wario is just, he's just code. He's just programming, mm -hmm. which means he's never going to be able to find love, ever. He's not going to, he's not going to be able to feel love. He doesn't know what it is. He, he's not even happy about this. He doesn't have feelings. He's a piece of shit, garbage, dumpster, trash man. It's two minutes till showtime. Now there's a soft drink from the Coca-Cola company that makes it fun to be thirsty. Discover Fanta brand flavors. It's one minute till showtime. <whistles> yes, sir. The hot dogs at our concession stand do rate an appreciative whistle. You'd like. <laughs> I want to know the answer. Yes, there is. Mm -hmm. <sighs> yes, and now we're out of vowels. Banana. Convenience store manager. <laughs> I'm gonna make all the money it now. Just as easy to be a convenience store banana. Settle back now, content, comfortable, well fed, and ready for some fine entertainment. Is everybody happy? Then let's go. And now
now, ladies and gentlemen, time for the show. Once again, thank you for coming to our theater tonight. Have an enjoyable evening. The refreshment stand will remain open for a short time. Still plenty of time to get a snack or cold drink. We'll make an announcement before the stand closes to give you plenty of time to get that last minute treat. Hello, I'm back. Who's ready for bingo? Yeah, my arms. Don't look at them. You're not allowed to look. Mm, what a hamburger. It's hot here. I need to wear a tank top, but you're not allowed to look. Hello, everyone. Uh, sorry for the delay on bingo. If you weren't here at yesterday's stream... Uh, then you missed my story of a moldy, uh, a moldy leak situation behind my fridge. <clears throat> so that's uh, being dealt with. A new development is that last night I I, I found another leaking wall uh, downstairs, and the plumbers that came to fix part of the kitchen had uh, dislodged a pipe. And so when we ran the dishwasher, all the water <laughs> went into my closet. Uh, and then, uh, you know, we didn't know about it. So we had some spoiled milk that also ended up in my closet. <laughs> it's just been... Ah... <laughs> Anyway, that's what I got going on over here. I'm going to not dwell on it today because I would rather not think about it. But um, if I'm sporadic in posting, that's why. I know I'm behind on VODs. I'm going to try and get caught up on VODs by tomorrow. Um, but my apologies for any delays. It's... Uh, that's not totally an excuse, but it is an explanation. That's just been fun. So today, we're going to... Let me read some things. And we're going to play some bingo. Hoskamus, thank you very much for the 50 months. Magnum Default, thank you for the 5 months. Tempo the Tantrum, thank you for the 4 months. Hyped for bingo, but nothing can be better than Gubble. Well, it's sure better. Um, it's sure better. Or there better be something better. I'll get back on, uh, <laughs> I'll get back on track here in a second. I need to get back in the groove. I got, I got milk, the milk smell is still in my brain from cleaning up last night. Tongs McKenzie, thanks for gifting that sub. Taste Studies, thank you for the 54 months. 54 months, and I can finally catch a Bingo 98 stream in real time, hitting the jackpot today. Good to see you, Tay. Lasagna Dog. Thank you for very much for those 20 dollars. Thanks so much, Lasagna Dog. How did the milk get in the closet? Well, the the burst pipe, or the, the dislocated pipe, was in the closet, well, in the, the closet crawl space area. And we had some spoiled milk that was poured what down the sink. And so the milk went from the sink into the closet. So awesome. <laughs> awesome. Ashy Tigerable. Thank you for the 31 months. Hey, Ian. Serious coinage here. That's big money. Excellent. Oh, man. You know what I hate even more? You know, they... They did all this to me, and they're not even going to come, come out and fix it until Monday. So we just can't, like, our kitchen is pretty much unusable <laughs> at this point. Ashy Tigerable, thank you for the 31 months. Hey, Ian, so glad I could finally make another stream. Loving your new vids. Also hope you had a good birthday. Mine's in nine days. Hey, happy pre-birthday, Ashy. They're going to not charge you for the first repair? Well, they already did. They better not charge me for this one. Why 
Walnut 440. Thank you for the three months. Cup of Tech, thank you for the 39 months. This is Sheldon. Thank you for the prime sub. Gin Cartridge, thank you for the three months. Sam Dub One, thanks for the $15. Hey, Ian. So glad to see Bingo back after your moldy week. Here's some money and my day two bingo scores. Uh, day two Hot Wheels slot car racing got a 6 out of 10 and Junklin Jam got a 4 out of 10. Thank you very much, Sam. Uh, Petit88, thanks for the 23 months. Tongs McKenzie, thank you for the $2, well, 245 bits. Got to work third shift. Hyped to watch this on YouTube later on. Have fun, chat. Have fun, Ian, with your moldy milk. Oh, it's a blast. Bad milk. Harkwit. Thank you very much for the $5. I will never forgive this heinous delay. Please accept these $5 as a token of my anger. Grrr. <laughs> Thank you very much, Harkwit. Okay. Let, uh, <laughs> pour some milk out in our closets in solidarity. <laughs> He's going to make all the money now. Yeah, especially if you have the, the Bingo 98 flesh shirt. You could wear the flesh shirt, pour some milk into your closet, and you can experience what it's like to be me. You'll basically become me. Sam Dub One, thank you so much for the $30. More money and day three scores. Day three scores, Gubble got a 5 out of 10. Legend of Kyrandia got an 8 out of 10. I liked Legend of Kyrandia. And Horse Illustrated Champion Season gets a 2 out of 10. Are you kidding me? That game was dope. Thank you very much, Sam Dub one <laughs> So call these for some strange rituals. Uh, well, hey, if you dump milk out in your closet, be sure to use the hashtag uh, StinkyClosetMilk. Uh, and you can be entered in the raffle to, I don't know. I'll develop that joke. I'll I'll come I'll swing around back to that when I have a, a conclusion. Okay, let's play some bingo, why don't we? Huh? Let's play some bingo. Oh, I got a I got a mic up. I forgot about my mic. Yum yum. Don't understand how to play bingo along. Uh, well, I will explain the bingo rules. Yum, yum. Yum, yum. Okay, hopefully this works. <laughs> Get a moldy milk spot on the floor of the winner's lounge. There you go. That's not a bad idea. Okay, you guys hear me okay? I sound all right? I mean, I'm not gonna sound as good as my main mic, but it looks like I'm being heard. Okay, sick, sick. All right. Let's... See where we were at when it comes to this bingo board, because it has been a while. Uh, if you are new here or you don't know uh, how to play Bingo 98, it's pretty simple. Games are randomly chosen uh, using this bingo Cage. We draw a number corresponds to a game. We will play that game in 15 minute chunks. Chat will vote on whether we continue to play or draw a new bingo ball. Along the way, we can win sub drops uh, in which I, I buy subs for viewers. And these up here are our big ticket items. I got to turn this on. These two determine what I will play after this season of Bingo 98 concludes. And you gotta get two lines on here. 
So the season has already gone on for so long, and it's going to go on for much longer. We can conclude the season next year, okay? I also have some power-up cards, uh, and we'll get to those when we get to those. Everything makes sense? No? Uh, just stick with me, and it, it will make sense eventually. Probably. G51. G51. I already see one. Boom. Uh, and that's it. That's it. Any power ups? Oh, I do. Hey, uh, let's try one of these Dalbers. I was gifted a number of different uh, bingo Dalbers. So let's see if it actually, let's see if it works. Can I, can I hold and, and daub at the same time? 51. Yeah. That's satisfying and also <laughs> extremely wet. Okay, let's see what game G51 is. A light touch may be needed with the daubs. I like to, I really want to make sure it's, I'm very firm though. <laughs> Wet soggy bingo card. Oh my God, is it? Okay, I was gonna say, isn't there music playing? There's supposed to be music playing. Come on, give me something good. Something not moldy. Please don't be mold related. <laughs> okay. Uh, well, I know you guys are going to love this one. Tiger Woods 99! Everybody loves Tiger Woods and golf, right? I think we've had this bread before. Delicious. Without wood, a fire goes out. Without gossip, a quarrel dies down. Is charcoal to embers, and as wood to the fire, so is a quarrelsome man for kindling strife. <laughs> Jeez. Jeez. Uh, Harkwit, thank you very much for the two dollars. Closet uh, tres leches in esta economía. Si. Si. So CJ Coma, thank you for the $2. Sorry to hear you've been going through it. I know this isn't much, but I hope it helps even a little. Thank you so much, CJ. Honestly, you guys just here hanging out with me, uh, distracting me. Much appreciated. Uh, this, this should be fun. Well, maybe not this game specifically, but this, in, this experience today in general should be, <laughs> should be fun. Uh, Silver EXVII, thank you for the 14 months. Ashy Tiger Bowl, thank you for the 300 bits. Help to de milk the closet and cheer you up. Thank you very much. The thing is, I, I think I got all the milk out, but it still smells a little funny because uh, the crawl space is open. I think it's just the smell of the crawl space. It's difficult to know. Febreze. I don't want to like Febreze any like over a specific pro like I don't want to mask a problem. I want to solve the problem, right? Ooh, baking soda is not a bad idea. Anxious Bean One, thank you for subscribing. Match Attack TV, thank you for the eight dollars. Hi Ian, we're playing Magic the Gathering and we have you on our TV. Can you bless our game and tell our friend Ian? To go easy on us? Is that how he spells it? E-A-N? Trying to decide if I should have a kinship with Ian or if I should be against him. 
since uh, it's spelled differently than my own. I'll have a kinship. I think Ian should just dominate. Don't go easy. If they want to win, they should get better cards, right? Thanks so much, Mad Attack TV. And Burger She Wrote, thank you for the $5. Excellent Dowbage. Thank you so much, Burger She Wrote. Can <laughs> you hear the groans now? Okay. Well, now we're installing. I really, you know, I really want to play more Sims. Uh, I really enjoyed our Sim adventure yesterday. If I hadn't been so insistent that I was going to bingo today, I might have just played more Sims. Yeah, thanks for ev thanks for everybody who uh, voted for it. What about Mita? Happy Canada Day! What are you guys doing for Canada Day? What is it? What is a typical Canada Day celebration uh, entail? I doubted you at first. I did. I'll always doubt you at first. I doubt everything. Fireworks poutine. Wearing a hat. That sounds like a pretty intense celebration right there. Which Sims did we? We played Sims 1. I will hopefully be... Honestly, I, I'm hoping to just relax on the 4th. Because the 3rd is when... Uh, the mold people come to tear up the house and when the plumbers come to fix the thing. So I'm going to be preoccupied on the third. So the fourth, I'm hoping, is just going to be very uneventful. Is there a chance we could get Sims 1 stream but with various custom content installed? I didn't know they had custom content for Sims 1. Firework banned here this year because of forest fires. Yeah, that's makes sense. You know, drone light shows are kind of becoming the replacement for fireworks. And I do love a good firework. Firework. And I was very unimpressed with drone light shows at first. But there's some pretty cool ones now. I would go see a drone. D the thing is, do you hear like do you, can you, I guess you can hear them. Does it just sound like a swarm of bees in the distance? Because I don't know. Maybe you play, you bring headphones and play some music or something. Angry wasps. Combine drones and fireworks. That would be cool. If they shot down some drones with fireworks, I'd watch that. I'd watch that. Mold news. Yeah, I had some mold news, Jarvis. I feel like I'll just keep repeating myself all stream. It got worse. Yeah, it got worse. <laughs> it got worse. More wet, you know? Everyone loves a nice wet house. Oh, I gotta get my timer ready while I'm sitting here. The wetter, the better, right? Maybe the heat from all the fireworks on the 4th will dry it out a bit. Oh, wet breads? No. Bonk. Uh, sure, let's order, uh, add a shortcut. Do I want to add a shortcut to the AT&T WorldNet service? Probably not. Mm -hmm. Should I change the resolution? I think I should change it before I run it. Don't forget to water your baseboards. They get thirsty. There we go.
Let's see what you got. Uh, would you like to check for updates? No, I can't. No updates. EA Sport. It's in the game. Sure is. You thought golf was knee socks, wooden clubs, and plaid pants. No. Guess what? We wear real pants. Slacks. Polos. Baseball hats. Fashion. Base is going for it. <laughs> -na 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 -na. Do I get to do tricks? Are there like golf trick shots I can do? Can I do that thing where you like? Hit the ball up a few times and then you. Nice, Bob. If it's in the hole, that's huge. Nice, Bob. If it's in the hole, that's huge. Nice, Bob. Is this a porno game? What is. <laughs> what is Tiger gonna get up to in this game? Uh. Stroke play? Yeah, let's stroke skins game. Okay, I'm just going to play. Oh. Okay. Maintain bounce. Maintain bounce. How do I go? Maintain bounce. Maybe I should do print. I don't. How do I go? Uh. Which golfers? Okay, I guess you set the settings and then go back. Box on number one. Back to the main menu. Okay. Where's the wind? Wind is uh, a little to the left. Did I probably fuck that up? Really quick from the top on. Ooh, yeah, I didn't get anywhere. <laughs> the ball typically releases a little more when you're hitting to a green above you. Uh. Not bad from the thick. Stuff. Okay. Okay, that was better. Against shooter, I have no idea. I guess I wouldn't be surprised. A little longer than the yardage, and shots will release to the right. Everything at Pebble breaks toward the ocean. Uh huh. Something about an, a pebble ocean. Oh, why is it releasing so late? Almost whipped it. Players can get aggressive hitting to these center pin positions. Okay, I gotta hit it early. I think I'm on like a tiny delay. 
Yeah. Fourth shot. Oh. Hell yeah. Has to play this to move right. It's fast too. Uh, I can't see shit. I love how smooth the F and B motion is. Who's a big golf fan? I know we got big golf fans in here. Give me a good golf fact. What do I not know about golf? Oh, fuck. How to putt, apparently? Jeez. At the second hole. You can eat the balls? That's pretty cool. Oh! Right foot might have slipped. There we go. I was just trying to get over here uh, to the, the, the easier T. Uh, see, now, now I can really get a good, a good shot. Oh, oh. See, now I'm winning the tournament. Assuming that I'm in, I'm in a tournament. Oldest golf course in the world is St. Andrews, Scotland. That's kind of cool. Oh. He lost his balance. I think I lost my balance on that one. The stronger players have an advantage when the ball gets down in this rough. Oh. I would assume the stronger players have an advantage just all the all the <laughs> all the time. Oh, come on. That should have been a slam dunk. They got slam dunks in golf. This left on the low side. Oh, my timing is real bad. Wow. Wow. Does kind of make me want to watch Happy Gilmore. It's been forever. I wonder if I would, if it would like still make me laugh. Or if I'd just be like, yeah. Oh! Think it holds up? I can't think of another golf movie that I would watch. I never saw Caddyshack. Oh. oh, come on. Just didn't seem comfortable over that one. Do Tiger's playing like shit, not me. Trying to figure out how much distance to take off for this downhill shot. No distance. We hit it as hard as we can. Anyone make a mini golf movie? Went down and Oh no. Oh no no. Okay, it's fine. Mini golf movie could have some uh, potential. I could see that as like a uh like a decom. Looked like a wedge. Were the mini golfers? Oh my god, Kevin James. Okay, yeah, I could see a Kevin James mini golf uh movie. Simpsons episode about the mini golf tournament. Oh, yeah. I don't. I don't know. I don't like know any Simpsons. I I know the movie. Those bogeys can be hard to swallow. 
It's, it's very sexual, this game. Just the phrasing. There we go. There we go. That's what I like to see. Shouldn't have any trouble reaching the green from there. Okay, okay. The sexual stuff is foreshadowing. They just knew. They knew. I love the camera work on the little tiny, uh... Little tiny screen. Oh my god, the people hiding in the bushes back there. Come on, come on. That was my chance to get what I'm assuming is par. Oh, fart. It's fine. Solid hard. Okay. I almost had a birdie, dude. Anyone here been to a Top Golf? I've always wanted to go, and I still have yet to go to one. Oh fuck! Looked like he rushed that one. I think I rushed that one. Oh. Top Golf is fun. How's the food? I mean, clearly I'm mostly going to be concerned about the golf, but you know, it's good to know. It's good to know how the food is. Expensive? Oh yeah, I'm sure that entire trip is expensive. Top Golf cannot be cheap. I know that they uh I know that they have some Top Golf like just restaurants. Like they don't have the golf portion, they just have the food portion, which is a little bizarre. Pretty firm in this bunker. Top Golf is uh it's it's like the golf equivalent of a bowling alley. It's like a big driving range where you go and uh, they have little like targets you can hit. And they serve you food. It seems fun. Multi-level driving range, yeah. I am I just stuck in the dirt over here? All sitting up in this fairway bunker. That'll help with this shot. How do I... I really want to just fucking smack it. I'm lost, dude. I'm lost in the trees. $200 for one hour without food? It's expensive. How much is it to bowl? You know? Can't be that much for a... Oh, mulligan, yeah! I wish I could forfeit the hole. Just be like, give me a, uh, you know, I tap out. Oh. Ba -ba -da. Room around the hole. It's in the center of the green. Great advice. Driver. Can I change to, like, a wedge? I guess I thought it was, like, automatically changing my clubs, but maybe it's not. Bum, ba -na. Bum, ba -na. I don't have a twin. Oh, well, no, I do have a twin. I have a twin. Tell everybody... Spread the, spread the rumor that I have a twin. I'm fine with that. When I said I don't have a twin, what I meant to say was I have an identical twin. Looks like the flagstick is right in the middle of the green. Yeah, dude. Good driver. Yeah, yeah. I need a wedge. Fuck. 
I'm just going to end up back in a stupid... Rough. Uh... Oh, there we go. That looks okay. Oh. Where'd the pole go? There it is. I do not have a twin, though. <laughs> I do not have a twin. Spreading lies. Oh. Come on, baby. No, I got like three feet. You guys don't want to watch more of this? This grass is really long and thick. It would take a good shot to get it out. Uh-huh. Okay. Long and thick. They gotta, you know, finish it off with a good one. How do I get out of here? Let me out of here, tiger. How do I... Come on, tiger. Let me... Let me out of here. Uh, let me out! End game. <laughs> uh, yeah. Ah! Great music. Okay. Let's get a better game. Shall we? Uh, okay. Here we go. Ah! Do I uninstall the old games or keep put, piling them on the hard drive? I, I uninstalled all of them after season one. I don't know that I did that for season two. I think I'm just kind of piling it on. All right. Let's pull another number here. G48. G48. Hits another one there. Uh, that's it. Getting closer though, getting closer. No, nothing over here. G48. Now, who's on Team Thrillers versus Team Second Chances? Curious. Ooh, you think, uh, think Nancy Drew? Ooh. 48. Oh, I'm pretty sure uh, PBG gave this one to me. In the line of duty, firefighter. Excited for this one. Should be a little more engaging than golf, you would think. I have no idea if Games, Game Grump played that. I'm assuming Game Grumps has played about everything at this point, so probably. They keep a running tally of, like, how many games they've played. Yeah, this is appropriate for the season. You miss anything good? No. You missed golf. Wasn't exactly thrilling. game for the warrior spirit and manly men so far that's been this stream's theme very manly games thus far I think game grumps is over is it what do you think they're gonna do with smosh I didn't watch any I didn't watch the like we bought smosh video or anything I just know that it happened
bum, bum, ba, dun, dun. Forgot about Smosh? Uh, yeah, I mean, I haven't... I haven't, uh... Partaken in quite some time. Ian and Anthony are making scripted videos again? That's interesting. I feel like I was just asking if, uh... Like, like there was good sketch comedy on YouTube right now. Smosh is an old... YouTube channel. Super old YouTube channel that was sold and now the original creators bought it back or something. Oh shit! I've played a game by these guys. Oh! Ready to go in there and risk my life. Choose career. Blade Jackson. Hot Rod Stein. Spitfire Lee. Smokestack Williams. Brushfire Miller. Or Savior McDunnan. Man, the choices. I think I like Smokestack Williams. I'm going to go with Smokestack Williams. Incident Briefing. 107 Clay Street, Residence. Hey there. Uh, this is Fire Chief Johnson. I'll be working with dispatch from the station and giving you tips along the way. A fire has been set by an arsonist at a two-story house on Clay Street. We need you to go in and save anyone trapped inside. You know, the police say that they think there is a full family still in the home. Get in there and get those people out to safety. I know you're still a little wet behind the ears, but this fire doesn't seem too bad. <laughs> Here are some tips. Don't be afraid to use that axe of yours to break down doors and clear debris. Don't get too close to the fire. Use your heat sensor to keep yourself out of excessive heat. Okay. I wonder if I can use my uh, wet ears. Oh my god. Hold on. I can hear you guys. I just got to work on getting up the stairs. Okay. Breakable objects indicated by a crack. <laughs> Over where? Oh, there's a person. Why don't you just walk out, dude? How do I? We got a live one here. I guess I'll just like walk through it. <laughs> That's funny. Okay. Here we go. Over where? Can I put the fire out? I don't think so. I just have an axe. Should, dude should have just opened the door instead of standing in the room with all the fire. Oh, there's a downstairs. Hit them with the axe? I don't know. Over where? Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Ah! I'm coming. Why can't they break down the walls? Ah!
It's like a platformer. You're fine, you're fine, you're fine. Okay, okay. I did not play this game for an old video. I did do a video on a game called Firefighters something or another. Oh! Oh man, Psychic Detective. I remember really loving that video. Are they downstairs? Are they in there? Over where? Can you like... I'm downstairs. I'm... Oh. Oh, come on. Ah! How do I... Okay. Boom. Heroic fighter, firefighter, rescues helpless victim, victims from Blazing Inferno. You're not even gonna use my name? I picked out a cool name and everything. Smokestack Williams at it again. Smokestack Soggy Ears Williams. Okay. Good job saving the family inside, but our worries aren't over yet. We need to contain the fire from spreading to the other houses and try to stop further damage to this house. The dangerous part of this call is over, but finishing this sucker off is paramount. Keep the hose steady. Don't waste water. Only spray fires with an orange or red circle around them. Blue circle will highlight fires that your spray is hitting successfully. After you have put out all the fire in a spray spot, you will automatically move on to the next one. Okay. I do feel like I'm in the line of duty right now. That didn't do super well. That, okay. A little difficult. I, I thought I was going to have more time, honestly. Okay, I'm getting the hang of it. I'm getting the hang of it. Ah! Okay, I'm aiming with the mouse. Uh, I think I was trying to conserve water too much. But now it's working. It does kind of like lock on. Oh shit. Come on, come on, come on. Really hard to keep track of that cursor. Hell yeah. Skilled firefighter douses burning building, protects nearby structures. Front page news. Just like in real life. A lot of uh, local firemen making the front page.
now what do, now what do I gotta do? Okay, another set of action. Looks like a late call for a, a house fire on Rumford Road. Police say that the entire family is still inside. We have information that the fire is the fire started in a downstairs living room by way of the fireplace. How did you get that information if the fire if the family's still anyway, okay. Get in there and save those people, then get out fast. We don't know how long this puppy has before it goes down. Oh, there's a puppy. Now brace yourselves, because I'm headed into the line of duty. Oh, I've got a fire extinguisher this time. Oh, well, you shouldn't have set the fire outside of the fireplace. That kind of seems like... Go out the window, dude. I love the graphics of this game. Uh, very cool. I wish I could look up and down. I need to turn my... Good, great. Is this not working now? Was that a monster? Okay, I think that was the only one downstairs. Mm, what a hamburger. If that was someone dying, I mean, they're being very dramatic, I feel like. Jeez, okay. Upstairs then. Some doors cannot be opened. That's a good life lesson. Fucking ow! Well, I died. Oh, do I have to go save myself? Oh my god, I do have to go save myself. <laughs> okay. Anybody's in there. Someone's chilling on the bed right next to the fire. Come on. Boom. She's praying. I didn't have my daily bread today. Okay. Boom. No one has been like crying for help here. It's made it a little more difficult to know. Oh shit, am I out of I'm out of fire extinguisher. Oh fuck. Great track. Oh, shit. <laughs> Boom. Oh, 
I, th I think I did a pretty good job there. I could be a fireman. That's what I, my takeaway from this game is that I could be a fireman. Might get this game off eBay. It's not bad. This this definitely feels like one of the more complete. Both even this and Tiger Woods too. Both feel like uh, like games. I don't think the games we play on here don't always feel like games. Great job. That family owes you their lives. Yeah, fuck yeah, they do. I expect repayment. You're shaping up into quite a firefighter, but just like before, we need you to contain this sucker before it gets dangerous to the surrounding area. Use what you learned from that last call and do your best to get this fire out as quick as possible. <laughs> Gubble. Okay, that's true. Gubble did seem like a fully fleshed out uh, arcade experience. You can now vote. Uh, player pass on firefighter search and rescue as I take care of this situation over here. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. You know, I'm, I'm remembering now that I, I turned off Hardware acceleration? I wonder if I turned it on if it would run even better. Come on, come on, baby. I didn't realize being a firefighter was so easy. What a what an easy job. I'm gonna part time as a firefighter to make make money to pay off my mold. Play this with a race wheel. Jeez. This house is going to be fine. I think it's going to be totally fine. They'll be able to move right back in uh, after we're done. Oh. Yeah, a lot of mold. I was I actually was just thinking about how wet this house is going to be. <laughs> yeah. I'm pretty good. I wish the newspaper would change. Okay, we're passing on firefighter. I did like this though. Uh, get me out of here. Feel like we've seen all it has to. Oh, you don't know. Different houses. Uh, different houses. Okay. We're off. We're off to get a bingo, maybe. 67 would do it. 73 would do it. 34 would also do it. I haven't decided if I'm gonna change out these bottom cards. I wasn't planning on it, but if we fill them all up before we hit these two, I might swap them out. We'll just have to see. Oh. Oh, 69! Everybody's favorite number. Everybody's favorite 
letter, I guess. Uh, didn't really do much. Yeah, didn't really do too much, but the game could be good. Oh, 69. Always hilarious. What's what's the funniest letter? P. P is a good one, actually. P might be the best one. P is a pretty. That's a pretty funny letter. O sixty nine. Oh, did I do this intentionally? <laughs> this is the. Stickman Bible Series, Book of Genesis. Oh, wow. All you perverts out there need to learn some God, okay? Yeah, uh, do the stickmen have a different god than we do? Be interesting to know. <laughs> it's our daily bread not enough. It's not. Start here. Welcome to the Stickman Bible Series Book of Genesis. We hope this resource will provide a valuable tool for your understanding and love of the Bible. Simply click on a button on the left to begin your journey. Uh, okay, we got a lot of... Uh, I think animation is what I'm interested in. Oh, they got screensavers, too. It's a lot of words for an animated... Uh, welcome to the animation segment of the CD. On the left, you will see a sequential pr presentation of great events that occur in the book of Genesis. And unlike most children's stories, uh, animation, and VHS video tapes, the narration is true to the text of the Bible and saves you from an individual's interpretation of, of what the text means. Yeah, but like what version? Isn't the version of the Bible an interpretation? I mean, I'm not going to get into it, but... <laughs> Although the animation itself is an interpretation by the makers of this CD, it is merely here to foster your own imagination on what these biblical events may have appeared in the writer's mind when they were inspired by God himself to write this book. Now, click on an animated segment to the left. Another window will open, and the story will begin. After the animated segment is finished, it will automatically quit and return you to this menu. Either click on another to enjoy or hit the back button to return to the main menu. Note, each segment is between 40 seconds to 4 minutes in duration. Oh, well, I better pick what... Uh, Fall of Man sounds cool. There's not going to be any nudity in the, in the Garden of Eden, is there? Uh... Let's just, let's do Fall of Man. Well, let's do In the Beginning. Let's see how it all started, and then we can, like, jump around. We need the prequel. Be patient, guy. Patience! In the beginning, when God created the universe, the earth was formless and desolate. Uh -huh. The ocean that covered everything was covered in darkness, and the power of God was moving over the water. Then God commanded, let there be light, and light oh. appeared. That was then nice he of him. separated the light from the darkness, and he named the light day and the darkness night. Mm. Evening passed, and morning came. That was the first day. I like how she said evening. Then God commanded, let there be a dome to divide the water and to keep it in two separate places. He okay. named the dome Dude. sky. There's not going to be any... I want stickmen. The Lord God took some soil from the yeah. ground and formed a man out of it. <laughs> uh huh. He breathed life-giving breath into his nostrils. I remember and the that. Man began to live. Yep. Then the Lord planted a garden in Eden <laughs> and placed the man in it to cultivate it and guard it. 
He told ah! <laughs> you may eat the fruit of any tree in the garden except the tree that gives knowledge of what is good. And it looks like a bad. spoon. Then the Lord said, It is not good for the man to live alone. I will make a suitable companion for him. So he took soil a bunny. and formed all <laughs> the animals and birds and brought them to the man. But not one of them was a suitable companion to help him. Then the so he took a nap. Then the man fell into a deep sleep and took out one of the man's ribs and formed a woman. Oh, oh. The man said, At last, here is one of my own kind. Bone Let's fuck! My bone and flesh from my flesh. Woman is her name. Time to bone some flesh. Okay. That was, uh, oh, well, we got Sodom and Gomorrah here. We gotta, <laughs> we gotta see what's going on in Sodom and Gomorrah. When the two angels came to Sodom, Lot was sitting at the city gate. Oh my God, I love that. Lot then invited them into his home where they entered. Uh-huh. Before the guests went to bed, the men of Sodom surrounded the house. They then called to Lot to surrender his two visitors as to do evil to them. Uh huh. When Lot refused, they moved up to break down the door. Dude, he opened the, the door inside, though. Inside, reached out, pulled Lot back into the house, and struck all the men outside with blindness. The two men ordered Lot to take his family and flee the city and not to look back. As Lot, his wife, and two daughters fled to the nearby city of Zoar, the Lord rained burning sulfur on the cities of Sodom and Gomorrah. As the two cities and the whole valley were being destroyed, Lot's wife looked back. Dumb and bitch. Into a pillar of salt. Come on. We need a firefighter. Where's Smokestack uh, Williams? Uh. Okay, I'll. Let's let's watch one more and then go see what the games are like. Uh Oh, these all sound real boring. Um a lot of Jacob Joseph. Let's see what the king is dreaming about. Sometime later, the king's wine steward and chief baker were put in the same prison where Joseph was being kept. Cool. After a time, they each had a dream on the same night. Joseph came to them in the morning and saw that they were upset. The wine steward said, In my dream, there was a grapevine in front of me with three branches. As soon as the leaves came out, the blossoms appeared and the grapes ripened. I was holding the king's cup. <laughs> Badass so dream, dude. <laughs> squeezed them into the cup and gave it to him. Sick. Joseph said, In three days, the king will restore you to your position. Please remember me and mention me to the king and help me out of prison. Then the chief baker said, I had a dream too. I was carrying three bread baskets on my head. In the top one, there were all kinds of baked goods for the king, and the birds were eating them. Joseph answered, In three days, the king will put you to death. Damn! Three days later, the king restored the wine steward to his former position. But the chief baker, he did as Joseph had said. Yet the wine steward never gave Joseph another thought. He forgot all about him. <laughs> After two years had passed, the king of Egypt had a dream. Oh my God. Standing by the Nile, he saw seven cows, fat and sleek, feeding this on This shit's grass. art, dude. Seven thin and bony cows then came up out of the river and ate up the seven fat ones. Yeah, I'm team bony cow. The king awoke. Then he fell asleep again and had another dream. Seven full and ripe ears of grain were growing on one stalk. Then seven thin and scorched ears of grain sprouted up and swallowed the full ones. In the morning, the king was worried. He sent for all the magicians and wise men, but no one could explain the dreams. Then the wine steward told the king about Joseph. 
the king sent for Joseph. The king told Joseph. And this is uh, dreams. It's an involved Joseph story. Said to the king, the two dreams mean the same thing. There will be seven years of great plenty, followed by seven years of famine. Uh huh. Now you should choose some man with wisdom to put him in charge of the country to collect food during the good years and distribute it in the time of famine. The king and his officials approved this plan. The king said to Joseph, <laughs> I love I the nod. You in charge of my country. Your authority will be second only to mine. Joseph collected food for seven years and sold it to the Egyptians when famine struck. People came from all over the world to buy grain from Joseph because the famine was Whoa, everywhere. Whoa, gray guys got the dick out. Okay. Let's see. Chapter review. I don't think I need to review any chapters. Uh, 250 questions or games. Which sounds more fun? Okay, no. No, no let's do games. <laughs> The Noah game. That's big money. Excellent. Oh, Vanna. Oh, wait. I got to create my own stickman. Oh, hell yeah. Uh, let's get some jazz while I... Uh, Okay, I like to stand like this, you know? You guys always see me standing like that. Uh, let's see here. Oh, here I am, I'm kneeling. Uh, Cause my enormous wang is just too heavy. I can't stand. I'll, uh, I'll hold, like, a cup over here. I'm also the king. Uh, mouth agape, as a king does <laughs> like to kneel. Oh, no, we gotta have, uh, closed eyes, probably. Yeah, there we go. I think that's, uh, that's pretty good. Maybe maybe a bucket down here to, you know, just just in case. <laughs> just in case. Yeah, we gotta catch the drips. <laughs> okay. Uh, is that it? Do I do I get to? S oh, I can I can move the cane. Well, let me, I'm just gonna move it up so it looks more. Uh, yeah. Is this the shirt? Oh, yeah. This is the season three shirt right here. <laughs> uh, get ready for it. Okay. Well, how do I get out of here? Oh. Let's play the Noah game. Can you help me? No. No. You will. Oh, fine. Oh, that's great. Yeah. Six of my animals are missing, and it looks like it's going to rain soon. That's that's tough. Can you help me find them? Oh, I mean, thank I could. You oh. So much. When you spot one, be sure to click on it to bring it to me. I'm gonna sell it to you. Uh, you have to be fast to click on this animal. If you miss him once, be sure to look in the weeds. Ah! Ah! Oh, shit! Oh, fuck! Good job. But keep a keen eye out. There's five more animals out there. Dude, he was fast. Now this next animal with care. Extreme care. Uh, uh, okay. Okay. Careful of the fucky kind. Careful of the fucky what? Ah! Ah! Good job. Thank you. Keep an eye out. 
there's four more animals out there. Be careful, this next animal will be tough to spot in the fog when you click on him when you can really see him. Wow, an elephant! Is that the elephant? Good job! But keep a keen eye out, there's three more animals out there. I just wrangled that elephant, no problem. Watch for this animal's tail, and I do mean watch his tail. Ooh, there's a skunk. Oh my god, how am I supposed to click on that? Ah! Okay, I'm just going to wait for him to come around again. Good job. But keep it keen. Good eye job. Out. There's two more animals out there cheater <laughs> uh wait till it stops moving then click before it runs away again great tip a horse you got him i did i did got him good job thanks but keep a keen eye out there's one more animal which which eye is your keen eye i'm assuming we each have one that's keen and not keen be careful when you click the mouse. Get that mouse! Is your do you have like a dominant eye and a keen eye? It's like one or the other. What? Oh fucking fart. Kids are yelling at me from across the room. Nice job, but it's starting to rain. What are you waiting for? Come on in. Wait, so are we Noah's family? Didn't he only take his family with him or something? Hey, right on time. Would you like to play or would you like to pass? He left me out. He said, come inside, and then he shut the door on me. This was pretty entertaining. I thought we would get maybe five minutes of it, but I was, I was pretty entertained throughout, I feel like. Bum, bum, bum. <laughs> Don't pass on God. Gerbert would be disappointed with the way this, uh, this vote is going. Okay, we'll pass. We'll pass. Uh, how do I get out of here? Coming soon, Exodus. Spending time with the Stickman Bible series book of Genesis. We hope you enjoyed our CD-ROM. Be sure okay. to come back soon. We'll be waiting for you. A little creepy, but okay. What's everybody's favorite book of the Bible? Anyway, let's play some bingo. Pretty good game so far. Not very good, uh, like marker placement or whatever. Let's, oh, I can't believe I've only pulled one of these special color balls so far. I-28, I-28, ugh, I mean, I see one here, not that it matters, uh, no, nope. Also, no. Swing and a miss. I-28. We're never going to get out of this bingo game. I'll be here... until the mold overtakes me. I said I-28, right? 
Did I say I-28? Fuck yeah. Bailey's Book House. Used to love this game. Not sure if we can get 15 minutes out of it, but uh, but let's try. I'd like to thank uh, Sonosuke Live for the $5. Hey, Ian. I've been a casual viewer for years. I quit my job two months ago, and I watched some of your stream archives. Now my time of unemployment is coming to an end, and I wanted to say thank you for the dozens of hours of entertainment. So have some money. Thank you so much, Sonosuke Live. Good luck on your, uh, your new job. And Forest of Wires, thank you for the 1,500 bits. I went some tr through some tragic life stuff recently, and to distract my brain from thinking about it, I watched an unfathomable amount of your vids. Paul Blart vid like a hundred times already. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much for all that you do. Best YouTuber in the game. Infinite gratitude and respect for what you do. Thank you so much, Forest of Wires. I hope uh, I hope things turn around for you uh, for you in life soon. Uh, thank you, thank you very much. Boop, 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 boop. I'm just thinking about mold now. Any anytime, anytime there's a lull, I go right for the mold. Oh, I forgot about the fucking peeking clown over here. Hi, I'm Bailey. Come oh. play in my book house. His freaky mouth. What do you mean baby games? You don't know that this is a baby game yet. This could be a game for mature audiences. You can read a rhyme. Ding dong dell. Kitties in hell. Cell. Ding dong dell. That's right, bitch. In the cell. That's what you deserve. Okay. Hickory, Hickory dickory, dickory dock. dock. The mouse, the mouse ran, ran up the cock. Sock. Hickory dickory dock. The mouse ran up the sock. Well done. Georgie. Porgy, pudding, and pie kissed, kissed the, the chimp, chimp and, made and made her die. Spy, Georgie, Porgy, pudding, and pie kissed the chimp and made her spy. <laughs> okay. Georgie Porgy. There's a good username. Any any big content creators going by Georgie Porgy? The queen, the queen of hearts. She, she made some, some farts. Uh darts. The queen of hearts. She made some darts. <laughs> Well, good for her. Anyway, let's uh, let's see what this fucking nightmare. Why is his shoes so detailed? Just like the tops of his shoes. Let's make a friend. Let's make a friend. 
Harder than it sounds. Oh my god, I don't want to be friends with this thing. Click the boxes to make a friend. Holy shit, no. Straight. Gotta be straight. Purple. Red. Green. Blue. What about normal feet? Big. No. Small. Yeah, those are some... Some non-threatening feet. Purple. Red. Short. Uh. Long. Uh. Curly. Yeah. Green. Blue. Orange. Orange. Small. Uh. Bright. Uh. <laughs> Orange. Uh. Purple. Red. Ah, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. That's right. Crooked. Ah. Small. Pointed. Curly. Oh. Ah! Orange. Purple. Red. Green. Big. Ah! Round. Oh, yeah, that's what we want right there. Here we go. This is our friend. This is our new best friend. Hello. My friend has hairy orange arms. Please click on the missing word that describes my orange. Yeah, Wonderful. I'm pretty, pretty great. No, don't my like that, though. My friend has... Harry, purple feet. Purple. Nice work. On a scale of one to ten, how hairy are My your feet? Has pointed blue hair. Please click on. A solid My seven. Oh my god! Please click on the missing word that describes my friend's arms. 2 slash 10. So, like, one foot is not hairy and the other foot is, like, covered in hair? Uh, curly arms. Curly. Excellent. My friend has... Your friend has problems. Dude, your friend's got problems. Okay. Let's see what's... This is the letter machine. Yeah, let's see. Bing! F. Foxes, fiddle. Thought they were gonna let me spell. I won't say what I was gonna spell. You. Unicorns use ukuleles. This is not true. You can't be feeding kids this information. They're going to believe you. C. Caterpillars catch. K. Kangaroos kick. Okay, that one's factually correct, I guess. Uh. S. Seagulls sweat. Did Bailey come up with these himself? H. Hippo. Herself? Pop. Did Bailey come up with it itself? I. Ibex. Iron. Ibex? What? I don't think I learned Ibex as a child. T. Tigers taste tacos. I'm sure he's licking that taco all right. Banana, 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 na. Me, me, bon, bon, no. Here come Edmo and Houdini. Uh. Go behind the doghouse, Houdini. I'm behind the doghouse. 
That dog just farted a sentence. Go on the doghouse, Houdini. I'm on the doghouse. Go in the doghouse, Houdini. I'm in the doghouse. I'm learning so much. I've always been confused about these words. Uh, but now that I see it really plainly laid out, I get it. Go over the doghouse, Houdini. I'm over the doghouse. Does not seem safe. Can you make Houdini go under the doghouse? I can, but will I? Yeah. I'm under the doghouse. Brag about it, Houdini. Houdini? Gee, no. On the doghouse? -da -da -na 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 -na. You can make a story. Oh, can I? How much freedom do I have? This is a story about... Oh, do I just pick? Uh... I guess the duck thing. Dorothy. This is a story about Dorothy. Okay. Mm, what a hamburger. Can I change? Harley. Oh. This is a story. Can't make a story about the refrigerator. <laughs> Dorothy. <laughs> okay, Dorothy. This Dorothy likes to ride. Hmm. What does Dorothy like to ride? The sun? No. Uh, magic carpet. On a flying carpet. Dorothy, Dorothy lost her fucking torso. Flying carpet. One day, Dorothy traveled to outer space. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what she would do. That's what one, one day, would do. Dorothy traveled to outer space. When Dorothy got there, she. Played the piano. <laughs> when Dorothy got this is a there, this is a trippy story, man. We need we need Joseph to come interpret this dream. This is a oh, don't read it again. Yeah, 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 yeah. Dorothy. Yeah, she sure does. One day, Dor Yeah, I don't know what's when up with Dorothy the shoes. When got there, she played the piano. The shoes are kind of freaking me out. I could print it if I really want. Well, I need the printer. I really need that printer, man. Bum, 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 ba -na -na. Beedle -ee, beedle -ee, do. It's a three-letter carnival. Click ah. on the grass to read and spell the word. <laughs> the Titan. Sub S U B Sub Sub just like to keep it culturally relevant. So Put what anything on the grass to read and spell the word bag B A G Pod P O Mug M Pen P Fox Cow Cod Rat Mat Tub Pig Cup Rod, cub, boy, bee, click, bat, bee, hat, dog, cat, pup, ram. 
A lot of interesting rug, log, words here. Pen, jam, sod, jug. What's your favorite word so far? J, sub, hay. Click anything on the grass to read. Ho. <laughs> it's the rhyming coaster. Fill all the cars and watch them go. Okay. Bat, but at hat, mat, rat. Got it. At rat. Excellent. Bat, hat, mat, rat. Thank you. I am very smart. Hat, mat. I hope you guys are uh, hat, impressed mat, rat, bat, with my knowledge. Hat, mat, rat, hat, mat, rat. What the fuck? Whippy. Cat. K at. Cat. It's first letter mountain. Okay. Fill all the cars to start the ride. Cat. C. Car. Cod. Cow. Cat. When did I learn how to read? Car. Just a couple weeks ago. Uh, using a lot of this Windows 98 software, actually. Very informative. Cow. Cat. Car. Cod. Cow. Cat. Car. Cod. Cow. Cat. Car. Cod. Cow. Cat. Car. Cod. Hen. H. Okay. Wow. Would you like to vote play or pass? Da -da 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 -da. I think that was it. I think this is just going to be like... Make a kid's card. Yeah, make something to print. Oh, actually, this, this looks kind of nice. Have a happy holiday. There we go. Well, that's a pretty good Santa right there. Bop bum 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 bum. Ba da 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 bop. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna take a little pee break. I'm gonna make it to pee pee, and then we're gonna do another uh, do another bingo poll. All right, everyone, take a break. Take a nice little stretch. I'll be back in just a few minutes. Uh. This could work. I might disappear. Yeah, that's fine. I'll be back. We are about to witness the takeoff of the first manned rocket to outer space. We pick up the count. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, zero. We're off to visit the planets. There are treats galore in the stars. Venus is loaded with candy. And ice cream is found upon Mars. The soda pops isn't on Saturn. When you're thirsty, it sure is the spot. And Jupiter's really jumping. With pop on this buttered and hot. But the best of them all is the planet. Where all of these treats are at hand. And that is the spot we now head for. Our theater refreshments.
Okay, hello. Uh, uh, there we go. I did not fall in. It took me a little longer because I avoided the downstairs uh, bathroom because it's wet. Yeah, I washed my hands with moldy milk. I was I was in, investigating the, the wet patch of carpet outside the closet. It's dry now, but it's unfortunately a little stained. I'm hoping I can uh, hoping I can clean it. But for now, let's pick a new game. And uh, maybe get a bingo? Mm. It'd be nice if one of these got a bingo today. Add some excitement to the mix. Put a plant over it. It's like right in the middle of the walkway. I can't put a plant over it. I-21. I-21. No. Are you kidding me? Okay, well, there's one on here. I haven't even used, I have three early votes. I haven't used a single one. There we go, that's a more reasonable daub, right? Those do look nice. I, I might start using those. I'll have to test how the different colors look uh, in the black light. I-21. Yes, we need two, two lines this season to complete the big ticket bingos. Early votes do not carry over. I gave myself two to start this, this season and I, I drew one from the basket. If I remember correctly. I said I-21, right? I could get up and look. Oh, hey. Uh, we're gonna play the Oregon Trail Classic Edition. I don't think I've ever played the Classic Edition. Moving right along. You know, we've done a lot of, uh, pulled a lot of numbers this season. We've had a lot of, like, misses, which means we're playing a lot of games. Can you be in the party? I don't know. It depends on, you know, it depends on who I put in the party, you know? How am I supposed to know that? Uh... Okay. C drive. Yes. Well, let's hope that this runs. Uh, I could put PBG in. He did donate uh, a decent amount of games. Uh. Yeah, just set up? Maybe I should have done set up instead of install. Uh, register Oregon Trail. Ah! Oh no, I did that. Install CompuServe. I don't want to do that. hot in here uh okay let's go look for it in the mecc folder
Have Kylo in the party? Maybe. I don't know that child. Kaleo? Mm, delicious. Yeah. I think I do want to run it. Utman1988, thank you very much for the $5. Ian, I hope your mold is well. The wife and I just adopted our fourth dog today. She's a retired greyhound named Primrose. I have four dogs, five cats, and a turtle. Press F to pay respects. Good luck unmolding. That is a lot of animals. Thank you very much, Utman. The mold is, I mean, the mold is thriving right now. It's alive and it's thriving. Uh, really great time to, to be mold in my house. What are the odds that this works? <laughs> the odds that the, oh oh. Did just restart? I thought it was going to... Okay, so that did not work. Okay, so I'm going into DOS mode, and then I'm going to go see MECC Oregon, Oregon. Is that what it is? See MECC Oregon, Oregon. Okay, you said F8 is how I get into... I'll try and get into DOS mode here. Bum, 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 bum. Anybody got anything good from the uh, Steam Summer Sale yet? I was browsing the other day. Didn't pull the trigger yet. Bum, 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 bum. Okay. It's beeping at me. It doesn't like... Okay. Kinna Bridge of Spirits. Darkest Dungeon. Okay. Okay. Assuming I'm going to command prompt only. And then I'm going to do... Let me CC... Oregon... Oregon? Oh, do I just do CD? CD, M E C C. No. CD Oregon. I'm just listening to what Jen Cartridge is telling me. Thank you, Jen Cartridge. The Oregon Trail requires a mouse to run. Please make sure that you have a mouse attached and a mouse driver loaded. I, sh I do. Run? Or do I just... Uh... What would you do here, uh, Jen Cartridge? Just, just type run. It's one of those games that requires a bit of configuration in auto executable to run the mouse driver. I don't know. That's, oh, that's over my head. Uh, either it works or it doesn't work. Uh, Command prompt doesn't have a mouse driver installed. Well, how do I do that? 
Is that going to take a long time? If it's going to take a long time, we should just save... Uh, we should just save Oregon Trail until I've done that. Pass on it. Thank you for your honesty, Zen. Uh, quit. Stop. End. Go away. Type win. Fancy. I should really learn command prompt. It's it's increasingly becoming obvious that it would be a, a skill that would benefit me uh, to know. Cast your... Cast your cares on the Lord and he will sustain you. He will never let the righteous fall. Mm, never, Lord? Are we sure? Never? Okay. All right, all right. Back to the board. I will, uh, I will set Oregon Trail Classic aside to remind myself to get the mouse drivers into DOS somehow. I'll just like stuff them right in there. It'll be great. It'll be great. Okay. Let's do it. Let's do it. I-27. I-27. I see a 27. I see that single 27. That's the only 27 of which I am familiar. But at this, you know, at this point I'll take anything. At least it's not a total miss. I-27. In my server as a vapor zone. Uh, I'll try and remember that. I'll try and remember that gin cartridge. But I already forgot what number. Like, I can't remember shit. I-27? You could add me if you wanted. I said 27, right? I don't want to spoil it. I, I am? Okay. We're going to play some Risk 2. Ooh, I, I'm actually looking forward to this one. I put this in here. Uh, I think it's been in maybe every season. I think I've just been waiting to play it. Risk too riskier. Ba -ba -ba. I used to watch my cousin play this game when I'd go over to his house. He always had Risk going. I read it. I read it. Never played it? Yeah, Risk is, uh, it's like a world domination kind of a game, but it's all, I mean, it's mostly chance. You just, uh, you roll dice to determine who wins, basically, uh, but it's fun. Risk is Civ for boomers. I don't know. I don't know. Civilization is so much more. Civ plus gambling. Civ is Civ for boomers. Yeah, that's... That's also <laughs> probably true. 
I want to play, uh, I really want to play the early civilizations that people have set in. I think it was two and three. They look cool. I've only played five and six, but I, I liked them. Experience the excitement of creating and running the ultimate amusement park. Design, demolish, test, and tinker with your creation in fun, easy, and addictive mega hit. A grade from Entertainment Weekly. Charming, engrossing, giggle-inducing uh, from CNET Game Center. Giggle-inducing? Addictive, creative, and heaps of fun. XCOM. Oh, my God. Alien C. Oh, Alliance. You beta tested Civ 2 and got your review published in PC Mag. That's awesome. I don't think I've ever played an XCOM game. Oh, my God. Why is that song in my playlist? Drive me crazy. Oh, this one was canceled? That's kind of cool. I mean, it's not cool that it was canceled, but it's cool that I'm seeing an advertisement. Majesty, the fantasy kingdom sim. Fi and enhance your kingdom with over 30 different building types. Your kingdom come alive as its growing infrastructure attracts new inhabitants, both good and evil. Eward flags to place a bounty on the heads of your enemies or spur your heroes to explore your Soro. Heroes from one of 18 different classes, including rangers, warriors, and wizards, 32 types of head-to-head -head or form alliances with other kingdoms as you battle in multiplayer quests of 19 epic quests. Key power of magic by casting spells against your most powerful enemies. I've never heard of this one. Majesty was so cool. I guess I have time to like look up screenshots. I don't really like fantasy kingdoms, so I don't know that I would love it. Wow. I mean, the screenshots look like uh Kind of like Age of Empires. Yeah, let's load it up. Uh, lo load up the desktop with with more and more little icons. Oh shit! What an ad! I could register and I could get free demos. Exclusive. Online offers, contests, new product releases, product enhancement. There's magic. We were just talking about magic. I don't know if, if Ian is still watching, but uh, I hope you're dominating all of your friends in that magic game. Uh, I don't have a fax. Mech Warrior. I remember buying Mech Warrior something or another, and it was I couldn't. I was just too complicated. I couldn't get the mech to move. I didn't know what the fuck I was doing. Preparing for battle. Cool. I don't remember that microprose intro. Oh my god. I don't even know how to read that. It's 
gonna get claimed. It's probably gonna get claimed. You don't have time to watch me play Risk for three days? Yeah, let's let's continue this game until I finish the entire campaign. Could be part of a brass section. I wouldn't play an instrument. I would just make noises. But I think they would let me in. Okay. Classic. Yeah. Let's just... Human. Oh, I can name myself. Seems fair. I'm just gonna leave everything the same. Just nice and basic. Oh, teeny tiny. You are about to start a three player game of classic risk. Each player takes each player takes it in turn to choose a territory. When all territories are allocated. The game will begin. Oh, is it my turn? I mean, I'm definitely gonna go for uh, Australia over here. Get someone from chat to hop on. Oh, what the fuck? What's this person's name? Back off. What the f Okay, okay, I got Madagascar. I'm locking down Madagascar over here. Oh, you. Okay, I can't, I can't let red get all of uh, this territory up here. Oh my God, oh my God. Ugh. Oh come on, come on! I could be connected. Oh fucking! Okay, okay, that's pretty good though. I'm I'm satisfied with that. Let's. Okay, I get me. I now am uh, in my own territory here. Now you must decide which areas you want to concentrate on and destroy or deploy your remaining troops accordingly. You should look for a good start position, probably. Uh, deploying around a speedo opponent. But bear in mind that you will have to stop other players gutting too good a start as well. Okay, okay. Where should I... Should I... I should... Ugh. Yeah, I'm gonna... I'm gonna work on my African... Uh, troops here. I feel like I got a good shot at taking over Australia, too. Because if I got them, you get... If you've never played before, you get bonuses. If you can take over an entire one, you get new troops every turn. Who, ha who does not know risk at all? Who actually doesn't know what's happening? I'm definitely operating under the... Uh, you know, I know what's happening. Really? Really? Holy shit. Okay, okay. So, basically, we all took turns placing one little troop 
on each territory till the map was full. And now we have, I don't know how many, oh, I've got five troops left. So we're beefing up certain areas. You can see here, this guy's got 15 in one spot. So if he comes and attacks my one guy, I think he gets three dice and I get one. And if I lose, he can move his guys into my territory. So you pretty much just go and you want to like get as far as, as you can in a turn, but you don't want to deplete your forces too much. Um, 15 here. This dude's going to move into Australia. Oh my god. This is going to be a disaster. Okay, so reinforcement phase. This guy's going to get four extra guys to plant. And now he's going to start attacking. He's attacking me. He's got seven guys versus my one. Oh, that's right, bitch. Okay, so it looks like he gets three dice, and we, we compare the highest one. I don't know uh, what happens with ties. Oh. Ian has been at overpowered in Afghanistan by someone whose name that starts with an S. Oh my god, is this me? Uh, it's gonna be fine. Space hamster. <laughs> yeah, space hamster can be green. Fuck. Okay, he's left nine here, so he might not come in here? I don't know. Okay, see, now the problem is he's gonna have this whole territory. So next time his turn comes around, he'll get a bonus. If he can hold on to this entire green section, he'll get a bonus amount of troops. Uh, I don't know how many. What is with the spy music? Yeah, we're getting we're getting pretty fucked right now. Okay, okay, we can we can have a stand here. Let's say no to to the green player. Fuck. Fuck. That's right. Ah! <sighs> okay, well, we, we got a dent. We made a little dent. In their troops. Our troops giant. Yeah, the troops are giant. Risk 2 takes place in a land where... Uh, all soldiers are like as tall as buildings. It's pretty cool. Well, I guess taller. Taller than mountains. I'm just getting fucked up over here. Has he attacked the red guy once? Okay. Another... Uh, Another phase, once you're done attacking, you can, like, spread your guys out. You have to leave at least one in a territory. Uh, but you can move people around. I can't believe you guys don't know Risk. I feel like a crazy person uh, explaining the rules of Risk. It's just... Uh, oh, okay, it's my turn. Okay, I feel like... Ugh. Okay, I get three people. What are the odds that I... Mm. Uh. Okay, I think I could get Africa. I'm just... I should not even placed people in America. I should have just left it alone. Attack phase. Okay, here we go. Come on, baby. dead before your time you mean the kids aren't gathering around playing risk
There we go. There's no TikTok risk trend going on right now. <laughs> risk in Fortnite. I really want to play. There's a version of Risk called something. Uh, I don't know why I started that if I didn't actually know the the name. But yeah, Legacy. Risk Legacy. It's this, but like you you destroy the board in ways like you get to rip up playing cards and edit the rules and the idea is that as you play more games it's constantly changing based on your past battles uh, I think that sounds super cool should I try oh yeah let's do it let's do it come on high rolls high rolls yes High rolls, baby. What up, Sean? Okay, that was pretty good. That was pretty good. Now I'm going to try... And, uh... Yeah, let's try and get North Africa here. Oh... Okay, Ty does go to Defender. Never played it correctly. I feel like that was kind of... rampant <laughs> when I was a kid. Like, playing board games kind of the way you're supposed to, but not really, and then being like, why is this game taking so long? Why does this game suck so hard? Okay. Forget about cards. I guess you don't play with cards in uh, in this mode. I know that... I think you're supposed to get a card when you take over a territory. Uh, and you're supposed to be... You redeem them for more troops. But it doesn't look like... Uh, it doesn't look like that's what we're doing here. Okay, well, I want to beef up Indonesia here. Can I move, like, everybody? Can I just move... Okay, no, you can only move two sets of troops. Yeah, I know one has to stay. I was wondering how, how many you could move around. I should have moved out of South Africa. I used to watch a streamer play a lot of Risk too. Like a lot of Risk too. Damn. Oh, they retreated. Damn. Oh. Okay, that was pretty good. I need more of that. I need them to, like, fight each other and basically lose all of their guys. So it's easy for me. Oh, fuck. Okay. See, I, I really want to win this because I want my troop bonus when my turn rolls around. There we go. Oh, did they retreat? That's right, bitch. It's now time to vote in the chat. Player pass. Okay, okay. Come on, baby. Come on. Oh. Oh. Do I get my bonus? Oh, shit. No, he's still coming. Come on, baby. Oh, come on. 
Come on, uh, Daniel. My one soldier. Daniel, no! It's okay. I'll still get Australia bonus. I think that one I got locked down. Ooh, I did not expect this. All right, we're playing for another 15 minutes. Okay, okay. Yeah, red is spread pretty thin. I think he did beef up. I think he's going for an attack here. Oh, come on. Come on. Fuck him up. I should consider going for America. America just looks, like, wide open. My audience likes World War. Yeah, that makes sense. Okay, okay. We need to hold on here. We gotta hold on. There we go. There we go. That's what I like to see. Man, lots of retreating going on. Should I consider retreating? I usually don't. I usually just like keep going. <laughs> uh, okay. Reinforcement phase. Okay, I have six reinforcements. I could definitely take Africa over again and then maybe move some people up here because I really need to uh, beef up this barrier. And then I could just kind of plant in Australia and I'll wait here. And, and if nobody decides to take it, maybe next turn I can have a go. I'm just going gonna, gonna to dump them mostly here. Yeah. Phase. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I could try and attack someone to stop Green's bonus. I mean, there's bonuses everywhere. This is going to be a huge bonus. But I need I need to protect my territory here. Uh uh okay. Oh, oh, uh, I'm blue, Sean. Oh, that's right, little fuckers. Okay, okay. Yeah, there's really nowhere. I mean, I don't want to deplete my troops here. It looks like if this is the turn order, it looks like red is next. So maybe they'll come in here. I don't know that I can. Well, I could try and disrupt his. Let me try and disrupt his bonus. There we go. There we go. Okay. I'm not in a singlet. <laughs> uh, I'm in a tank top. Okay, I'm gonna. I think I'm good with that. I think I'm good with that. I'm gonna re. I'm gonna. Tactical move phase. I'm gonna move my guys around. Let's get. Let's get more people here. Same thing. Oh, interesting. I didn't know that singlet uh, was, was and tank top were. I only moved one guy. When I think of singlet, I think of like a like a onesie.
Yeah, like a wrestling uniform. Yeah, yeah. That's right. That's right, baby. Back off. Okay, this one I don't care about as much, but I'd still like to fuck him up. Ugh. Come on, hold strong. Carl. No! Well, I'll always remember Carl as that guy that died when I specifically told him not to. Oh, shit. Yeah, Egypt is fucked. You back off, Green. Green got 11 reinforcements. Holy shit. Oh, come on. Come on. <sighs> We're playing Risk. Green's not going to win. I mean, Green's probably going to win. I wonder how the computers are. I wonder if wet Red will, like, realize what's going on here. And, uh team up with me a little bit I definitely should not have put extra troops in America I think I think my maybe my biggest mistake was was putting troops over here dude come on man This is not good. It's true. I could just completely change strategies and go all in on America. I'm trying to get good. I'm trying as hard as I can. I blame the mold. It's the mold's fault. Oh. I need to like sit back. I'm like leaning forward, hurting my neck. Okay, I get six guys. I was able to hold Africa. Um, let me think here. I feel like I should reinforce. But I also feel like I could... Yeah, I gotta reinforce. I gotta do at least... I mean, green is just gonna come in here and just fuck me up. Is that a two or a three? Is that a two? Attack phase. Probably a mistake. It's been a while since I played Risk. I, I don't really... It's a game that I... In my head, there's like no strategy for, but it turns out there actually is. It's just that the dice rolling is... Adds a, like a random element to it. Come on. Just shoot him. Come on, guys. Just fucking shoot him. Thank you. My guys can't follow orders. Um. Uh, okay. Okay. I could go in. Uh, uh, okay. So here, I feel like my options are, are push in to South America to break up this guy's combo. But if I let him have the combo... I wonder if he might try and uh, attack up here. Because the more I attack, the more... Uh, the more spread thin I get. Uh, fuck it. Fuck it. Let's just, let's just shoot. Let's 
just shoot and see what happens. Great. Great. Okay, I, I am going to see if I can... Ugh. I want to go in here to see if I can break up his combo, but... I'm going to have no guys if I do that. Tactical move phase. Okay, I got to get out of South Africa here. Let's go up. Oh, can you not... I thought you could move your guys anywhere as long as they were connected. I didn't realize you could only go into it like a space an adjacent space man I'm fucked so you only get to move guys once because I've only been able to move I haven't I thought I got two chances to move guys around Zedmore, thank you for the three dollars. Love your stuff. Don't catch the streams often, but good luck with whatever is going on in here. We're playing some Risk. Thank you very much, Zedmore. This jazz sounds like Breath of the Wild music. This song is definitely older than Breath of the Wild, so really what you're saying is Breath of the Wild music sounds like stock <laughs> epidemic sound music. <laughs> That's what I'm hearing. <laughs> Fuck. Beat a little, beat a little, little. At least he didn't get his bonus. Yeah, this one's a little too. It's not really my kind of jazz. It's not a bad jazz song. But it's not my kind of. Uh... It's a little too out there. Oh my god, we are so fucked. Oh my god. Yeah, next next turn I'm just going all in on America. I'm I'm bailing on Africa. And then maybe Red can like get something going and I can Sneak back here. Ugh. Ugh. Okay. This is where we make our stand. Uh, okay, that was a stand. That was a stand. Shame about Paul getting shot, but, you know, life goes on. Just not for Paul. Okay, okay. Come on, guys. There we go. There we go. Man, green's being conservative. Maybe that's how you win. Maybe you can't just, like, attack all out. Okay, okay. Oh, are you kidding me, snake eyes? Disaster. Does it, why is it so hard to conquer the world? Why is it easier? <laughs> Just roll good. I'm trying. <laughs> oh, okay. Time to vote, play, or pass. I think I'm going all in on America here. Green is just spreading like a disease. Oh, good. I get three troops. Really? Lucky day. Attack phase. Okay, we're passing. We're passing. But I'm going to finish my turn. Got to see how it ends. We're, we're going to lose. Sorry. End of attack. No, wait. I want to attack. Uh, we'll play a new 
one of these at some point. If you guys are actually into it. It seems like some people are into it. Okay. Come on, baby. I'll d I could do better next time. I, I just had to shake off the rust. Okay, I'm going to see how much of America I can take over real quick. <laughs> Great. Okay, one last fuck you to green here. Has a game ever gotten voted to play more than once? Yes. I think the the kingdom of whatever did I don't think Casino did Casino get voted twice? That the adventure game that I was playing, I think got yeah, Kyl Kylanthia or something. Yeah, last stream. I don't think Rugrats got two. Kyrandia, that's what it was. Rugrats got voted four times. Was I like begging to be released and not getting released? Okay, let me out. Uh, the casino game they're referring to is uh, Casino Empire. It was like a, a simulator game. If I beat games, I think we have beat games. I mean, we read through, we read through all of uh, Arthur's teacher trouble, so we beat that game <laughs> technically. Uh, well, I could have done better. Is what I'm seeing. What I'm seeing here is that I did. Even worse than I uh, thought. Just not a good, not a good look. I beat the Mr. Potato Head game. Wow, I managed to get all the way through that. I'm kind of impressed. Oh, right, the Scooby-Doo game. I didn't like the Scooby-Doo game very much. We finished it. It wasn't on, like, I, it was an after-party thing. It wasn't on Bingo 98. All right. I enjoyed that. I'm a fan of Risk. Gl glad I got to uh, risk it for the biscuit. Let's take another risk here and see. Well, I guess I'm not risking anything. There's no risk. Oh, oh, I got two. This one goes back in. G50, G, I feel like we're getting a lot of Gs today. G50 is good for thrillers. G50 is good for nothing else. Oh shit! Actually, I got a mini bingo. Let me dial bit. So now I have four extra votes, of which I probably won't use any because now I'm too paranoid to use the votes. Uh, G50, G50, G50. Votes for what? Uh, to, so I have, uh, oh no, I have four. So I have four little power-ups here uh, that I can use to trigger an early play or pass vote. Uh, so if the game sucks and I'm miserable, I can vote to skip it early. Uh, in previous seasons, I was just doing it whenever I felt like. And so this season, I was like, no more cheese in the rules. I'm going to make it official. But now that I have a limit, I'm way more conservative. And I'm like, I can get through this. It's fine. Okay, G50. Uh, is... At Adibu Reveal Your Natural Talents. Adibu. Ad Adibu. 
What do we think my my natural talents are? Do people know Addy Boo? I don't know Addy Boo. Collecting mold. Yeah, I'm sure I am uh, naturally great at having a sopping wet house. <laughs> honey boo boo. Yeah, Addy boo, honey boo boo. You know. Oh my god, why is he gotta show off his belly button? I don't need to Hello, see that. Buckaroo. I'm Addy Boo, and this is my enchanted playground. There's so much we can do here. You can plant flowers, play with magic paints, or build a doghouse for pups. Just click around to explore. Ready, Spaghetti? Let's go, go, go! Are we ready, Spaghetti? Oh, oh, oh. Build a longer shirt. <laughs> Gut out. Uh To get some fruit, simply plant a tree. I'm right here to help you. In order to plant a tree, simply click on me. What is Whoa. Okay, so I I planted a tree. An apple tree. It... Is that my natural talent? Why is a robot yawning? Data light says the fruit isn't ripe yet, but it will be very soon. Okay. Addy Boo is still staring at me. Welcome to my garden. Ugh. Flowers? Just I want you to pull your shirt down, dude. Down wherever you want. Then water the seeds and watch them grow. <laughs> Why do I have this game? Same reason I got Stickman Bible. Uh. You. Oh God, I don't like that. That's. <laughs> uh. <laughs> just for you guys. I do this for you guys. Okay. If I didn't play Addy Boo Discover Your Natural Talents, it could get lost to time. People might never look down into Addy Boo's cave of a belly button ever again. It's up to me to preserve this for history. I should get like... I should get some type of government sponsorship. I should be getting paid uh, to be an archivist. One of these days, the world will be in danger, and we're going to need to know what Addy Boo was like. Yes! But don't forget to come back to water the flowers. Don't fucking tell me what to do. Welcome back. What should we play now? Okay, what should we let's uh let's go in the house. One of these days his his belly button's gonna talk at me. I know it. Can I, can I go in the house? The flowers are like growing it. They're still growing. That's actually kind of cool. Persistent garden. Is he an a You can't just ask if he's an alien. You can't just ask that. Respect his belly button. My indicator light says the fruit isn't ripe yet, but it will be very soon. Jeez. Iron in the Gulf, thank you so much for the $6 and change. Bingo 98, season two shirt just came in, looking pretty great and fancy. I guess I haven't 
plugged the shirt, have I? Okay, I thought I was about to get attacked. There, you can still get the bingo season two official shirts at brutalmerch.com. Uh, everyone looks great in the Ian's flesh variant. It's uh, it's a great color that everyone looks <laughs> really good in. You're gonna look great in these shirts, okay? <laughs> What the fuck? How do I get in the house? See more? A <laughs> great advertiser. <laughs> Listen, I wear the shirts all the time, as you can see. Uh, ooh. Let's do music, melody, and rhyme. Zippy doo It's me, Addy Boo! My magic world continues to expand with music, melody, Did he just say zip you? Melodica, the land of music, and explore music fundamentals. With me by your side, you can even compose your own music. Come on, let's meet some new friends. Hello, I'm Addie Boo just fucking exploded. Orchestrator in the land of music. Four friends anxiously await your visit. With luck, you can help rebuild the Sigamajig Melody Maker, which was broken by Buzzy Galump. Fucking hey, buzzy galump. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Get me out of here. <laughs> oh my god. Uh oh well I can get my fruit. Is this just like a farming game? My indicator light says the fruit It's like every other game at the the wholesome game show. Where's the frog? Anyone spot the frog? Let's go into the tree's mouth. Welcome to the hollow tree. Yeah. Do you need a dog house for Puff? A no. Hive for the bees? No. A nest for the birds? No. On the dog house, the hive, or the nest. Who would win in a fight? Addie Boo or Gerbert? Dude, Gerbert would fuck Addie Boo up. Uh, okay. This one looks nice too. Whatever you want to do is up to you. Or he'd whine enough so that uh, someone would come and save him, like an adult would come and save him. Get Good choice. Thanks. I don't. What choice? What shall we play now? Interesting. Am I affecting the world? I mean, that is kind of cool. I wish I could go in the house. Oh my god, the house looks like his face. Is this supposed to be his belly button? I really don't like the dog. Does it say if this is a demo? I don't think it's a demo. Ah. Uh. Hey, guess what I, I'm going to use? Why don't we use one of my little things I said I'd never use? Might as well. Let's, uh, play or pass. Anybody want to play? Honestly, these, uh, these activity centers, I think, are some of the slowest things. They can sometimes be good, but, uh... Not really my favorite, this one. Oh, sick. We're gonna... It was great fun playing with you. Hurry back, Applejack. Oh, my God. Donation alert. Experts agree. Intelligence includes a broad range of skills, from music to science to creativity to logic. Addy Boo's world has a gazette Boo. to help your child discover their natural talents in all these areas and more. So whether your child loves to play in the garden or pound the drums, whether your child loves to solve puzzles or find out more about Pluto or Mars, the Addy Boo series is designed to complement your child. What if my child loves to beat Addy Boo up? Stuff them in a to locker. Find out more 
visit www.edibu.com or call 1-866-4-A-D-I-B-O. You think it's just a coincidence that backwards it spells Ubida? Edibu. Sounds uh, d- demonic or something. Okay. Well, that was an experience. But why don't we try to hurry up and experience something else? So maybe I can, I can forget about that. Here we go, here we go, here we go. B12, B12. That's good for second chances. That's a good spot, good spot. Uh, that's good on a card we've already hit. And that's it. Not on my uh, remaining power up here either. B12. Let's see here. I don't know what the fuck this is. Gearheads. Ge- Gearheads. I just called the Addy Boo toll-free phone number. It's an insurance company now. Did you ask them if they knew who Addy Boo was? Could you give me the number for Addy Boo? They must get calls all the time. People looking for Addy Boo. Yeah, we're playing Gearheads. I don't know what it is. Any companies on the disc? I think it said Philips. Get ready for Gearheads. Oh, well, this looks promising. Is this going to be like a contraption kind of a game? Uh, oh, wait. Oh, I thought it had an install music. Is it going to be like Widget Workshop? It does have a, a Gubble-esque uh, quality to it, that's for sure. What up, Famished? Okay, yeah, let's go ahead and give it a restart. I've been installing a lot of stuff. Do people send me these? Yes. Uh, some are my own collection. Uh, but I have also gotten a number of games in the mail. Almost too many games in the mail? That's what this... This lovely pile over here is me saying, Where am I going to put all this shit? Yeah, Sam Sam Dub is the uh the main offender here. <laughs> Keeping me trapped in in this bingo 98 uh nightmare. Now it's good. I haven't you guys got to remind me when my logo's off. This little logo here, I want it there. Branding's important. Now my numbers are really going to take off. Everyone's going to tune in now that the logo's up. loud if you can said jesus everything is possible for him who believes getting a little sassy in in mark here uh (laughs) jesus does is that sonic That is Sonic. What is Sonic doing here? (laughs) 
So, am I the chicken? Is that me? Oh. Gearheads. Yeah, why don't you tell me those instructions? Gearheads is a game of battling wind-up toys. To win, be the first person to get 21 toys across your opponent's side of the play field. Each toy has a different weight, speed, and style of movement. Most have special abilities, too. Once you release a toy onto the board, you don't control it anymore. Your opponent might even use it to score against you, so watch out. One more thing. Uh, as in Mongolian bear wrestling, you have to win by two points. Okay, arrow keys to select my toy, let it wind up. The more you let it wind, the more energy it will have. Use these keys to pick a release point. Okay, no mouse action. And then right control. Okay. Let's start at one. Oh, do I get to pick? Well, I gotta have Santa. Santa. Oh no, these are everybody. Disasteroid. Blast through any toy unfortunate enough to get in its way. Deadhead. Uh, flipping, flips their direction. Cluckedda. Watch Cluckedda hatch small fry, her lovable chick. Big Al. Handy. Mm. Ziggy. Ziggy is the, Ziggy the roach is the fastest wind up in the game. <laughs> Crush Kringle. Uh, well, I like Crush Kringle. Uh, Presto. Zapbot, I'll figure it out. Kanga Ruffian, I like that one too. <laughs> like Kanga Ruffian. Oh shit. What the fuck? Well, I think I lose. What the... Oh my god. Got any more of the early... See, this is why we don't... Don't we all wish we could go back to Addy Boo right about now? <laughs> oh, what is... No? You guys are crazy. This is all this is going to be for 15 minutes. I haven't even seen a single belly button. Yeah, no shit I lose. Oh no, do I have to play again? Oh my god. Yeah, well, yeah. So you gotta memorize like what each, he's like blocking me. You gotta memorize what each piece does. Can I just keep sending hands this way? There we go. I think this strategy is working out. This is fun. I mean, I'm already a pro. Oh yeah, sorry, uh, the right side is me. Uh, sorry, I, I guess I didn't clarify. 
Oh. Let's just do it. Let's just do it. I got mold in the house. I don't give a fuck anymore. I'll do whatever I want. Player pass. I'm using my little green token here. You better fucking pick pick pass. Or I will... I don't know. I won't do anything. Use another early vote, I guess. Just spend all of my early... Get me out! Get me out! It was almost a threat. It was, uh, it was the beginning of a threat, but then it uh, deflated quite quickly. Holy shit! Oh my god. I miss, uh, what was that? What was it? Gubble? What was the name of that game? So much better than, than Gearhead. I don't know what the fuck Sonic was doing on there. Yes, I have two early votes left. And remember, we haven't even gotten one bingo on the main two cards, so I should probably go back into conservative vote skip mode. Gubble. That's what I was thinking of. But for now, let's just see what else we can play. Gubble wasn't terrible. I mean, it wasn't it wasn't great, but it was better than that. Give me something good. I want a good game. I don't really care about a bingo. Just give me a good game. I-16. I see a 16. Right here. I see a 16 nowhere else. Nowhere else. Still no sub vote power up, unfortunately. Uh, I 16. I 16? I 16. Okay, this could be fun. This look, I haven't played this before, but it looks like it could be interesting. Bedlam? I don't know if I have Bedlam. I-16 is Lemmings Paintball. Uh, I remember playing Lemmings. I don't remember Lemmings Paintball. Is that an add-on game? I have no clue. If I need to have uh, the original Lemmings installed, I mean, we'll have to skip it. It's your favorite game as a kid? Well, you'll have to give me uh, pointers if I get stuck. Bum, bum, bum. Bum, bum, da, 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 da. Can I just play regular lemmings? I mean, I gotta play pin paintball. Well, I love that. Lemmings are cute. Debatable. Lemmings are cuddly. Oh, shit. Lemmings wouldn't harm a fly. Uh, 
Is this risk? Risk three? Yeah, right. Cold blooded, dude. Gregor Maltman is a pretty cool name. Oh man, Smokestack Williams. I can't believe I can't believe he worked on this game. Okay, okay. Oh, well, suddenly everything's much more uh, optimistic. Oh, it can, it's charting how much fun I'm having. That's cool. Easy zone. Okay, yeah, let's... Oh, hell yeah. I'm so good. Yeah. I mean, why even play the rest of the game at this point? Better write down this password. It was a real tough level. <laughs> tough level to get through. I like the the visual style. I mean, I don't like this. This is not the best depiction of a limbing. Okay, let's go. Oh, he can hop up a level. That's good to know. Will he just go, like, if I just click on the flag, will he just go get it? Yippee! Yippee, dude. Oh, I can get multiple? I see other lemmings down there. I see space for, like, three or four lemmings. Oh, this looks tough. How many people said they remember this one? I saw at least a couple. We're definitely getting to shooting people. It looks like we're going to pick up some paintballs this uh, book fair. Okay. How do I... How do I shoot? Hmm, not sure how I shoot. Is it right click? Okay, yeah, okay. Okay, okay, yeah, right click. A little difficult. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> that's cool, I actually liked that. Okay. I could see this growing on me. Anybody here a big paintballer? I've never paintballed. Gone once. Seems like it could be fun, but also seems like it could be not fun. Painful? Yeah, I did like laser tag. Laser tag's pretty sweet. Oh, you can shoot me over the fence?
Is is that does paintball hurt worse or does airsoft hurt worse? I remember my uh, friends being really into airsoft in like high school. Paintball for sure. It is a bigger projectile, but it's also... I guess I've never touched a paintball. I don't know... Okay. I imagine them, like, squishy, but I guess you gotta, like, keep them solid so they don't explode on the way out of the gun, right? Interesting. Where's, uh... I gotta go around? Big bruises. How do I get over there? This looks suspicious. Oh, okay. Uh, I probably should have gone back there. It seemed like something was back there. Yeah, airsoft is like those little plastic bullet things. Yeah, like the little teeny tiny ones. Oh, shit! Cool level. Okay, so he runs... Does he just run straight forward? Come on now. Uh. Oh, I'm gonna run out of time here in a second anyway. See what happens if I go into the fire. <laughs> Okay, I'll be careful this time. I thought that he had, like, pathfinding, but it seems like maybe he just walks straight to wherever I click. I don't know, he went around a fence then. Okay. Anyone have an uh, opinions on uh, lemmings versus worms? Two games that I always categorized in like the same folder, but I never really played. Worms is better? What makes worms better than lemmings? What makes worms different from lemmings? I guess I don't know how they're... I guess lemmings are just trying to get guys from one side to the other, and worms you're fighting other worms. Uh, for, uh, I don't know. Okay, I can't go in there. Oh, oh, I see like a... Well, I guess the question is, did anybody like lemmings more than worms? Because it kind of sounds like worms is the favorite. Yippee! Yippee! Makes me think, is it Smash that I'm thinking of when I hit the success screen? Is it the melee intro or something? Oh, 
Oh, come on. Think about Star Wars. I'm running out of ammo so fast. Can I catapult myself? Oh, shit. Okay, let's, uh... Can he, can he hit me from there? Oh my god, he can hit me from there. Are you, are you allowed to make the... The flesh-colored t-shirt sleeveless? Sure. You could cut the design out of the front and make that a poster if you wanted, and then your shirt would be like a cool... It's like an Adiboo shirt, only not just the belly button. What the f- We both got each other. Or a fleshy pillow, it's true. Pull size chest tattoo. Yeah, you could cut the design out, give that to a tattoo artist, they could tattoo the design on your flesh, and then the remaining shirt would be a window to your uh, tattoo. I think that's a pretty solid idea. Okay, this is this is getting difficult. Cuz you got to conserve ammo, but it's also hard to aim. Imagine tattooing a little fucker somewhere on your body. Maybe I will. Okay. Okay, better watch out. Better watch out. Yippee. Hell yeah. The <laughs> little fucker tram stamp. Oh my god. Bad idea. Oh, I have two. Looks like they both shoot. Oh, and I can control them separately. Uh, okay. Okay, am I gonna have to leave one behind? Is that kind of the idea? You go here, yeah. And you... Oh no, this is getting into like... Character management. Pick up the... Pick up the thing! Okay, I can't pick up the thing. Oh, wait, wait, wait. It's because I got this other guy selected. Okay. There we go. Bye. See you later. Yippee. The time has come to decide if we will play more Lemmings Paintball or if we will choose a new game. Vote in the chat. Play or pass. Definitely prefer this to the Sonic uh, 3D... Oh, they both died. The Sonic 3D game we played... Did not like. No, this one's kind of fun. Can you not climb that? Oh, I see. Yeah, was it Sonic 3D Blast that we played? Or was it Sonic CD? I, I forget.
3D Blast. Yeah, that one was hard to control. We got 3D Blast defenders in here. What you like about 3D Blast? It could have just been not good on my computer. Uh, it, it might just be better on different uh, systems. Did not like it myself. Was not uh, enjoying it. Barbecue, barbecue, barbecue. Alchemist G. Joe. Thank you so much for the $7. Hey, Ian. My boyfriend Aaron should be watching right now, recovering from his surgery. Could you wish him a congrats and a happy early birthday? Congratulations. Aaron, on getting your surgery done. Glad it went well. And I hope you're enjoying. Oh, hey. I know you. Well, I mean, I recognize you. Way to go, Himbo Prime. Have a, uh, have a smooth recovery. But for now... It's time to bingo. Uh, what's the, uh... Uh... Okay, this is the last pull. I've actually been going longer than I expected. Last pull. Last chance. I mean, for the day. How am I not getting these colored balls? It's driving me crazy. In 43. In 43. Good. That one's good. Oh. Okay. No. Still pretty good. Pretty good. Thrillers looks like they're in the lead, but not by too much. In 43. Pop. Pop. Oh. <laughs> Crayola. Amazing animals. The binder's getting empty. Like, we have hit a lot of games. Maybe new computer wallpaper? It's true. Blart Till You Shart has been around for a little bit. Do I need to add more games? Well, this is just, uh, this binder here is just for this season. So I'll add more games once the season's over. I definitely have enough for another season. Ah! Bingo wallpaper? It's true, it's true. Blart Till Your Shart, I think, was made during bingo, but doesn't really, you know, doesn't really refer to bingo. Another game you had in a row only owned three games. This is your episode. Bum, bum, bum. It was a post bingo drawing. Did I just Did I just decide to draw in kid pics or something? I mean, I believe it. Well, I'm glad I did it because masterpiece, obviously.
color. Okay. Planning on opening packages a stream? Uh, probably not. Um, honestly, I really feel like I need to, I need to deal with this uh, before I open any more packages because I, I've gotten in the cycle where opening packages just it destroys my office, and then I freak out about it. So I'm gonna conquer this pile probably tomorrow, uh, and then we can get back on the package opening train. Um, would I recognize your package, Mabel? I can put a thing on it to uh, remind myself to wait and open it when you're here. Bum, bum. Light brown. Light brown. Peach. Peach. Little crayon. Okay. Is it is it a white box? Let me leave myself a little message on it. Okay. Yeah, I put uh, I put a little note on there for me. In fact, if, if anyone is planning on sending me something, you could you could write a little note that's like, well, actually, maybe I shouldn't encourage that. Because <laughs> I've got to, well, I'm not going to encourage that. Never mind. Don't do that. I will decide which, <laughs> which boxes get held. Okay. Uh, red. Red. Oh, shit. It's true. I am the decider. Oh, that's cool. It lets you, like, color in the lines without trying. I just had a thought that if I if I suggested people write their usernames and have me hold boxes for when they're there, I mean, I'm never going to be able to open anything. Rose. Rose. Ugh. Uh. So tomorrow I'm gonna try and be online, but uh, I'm also gonna try and film. I wanna film something that I have to edit while people are like destroying my house on Monday. So I don't know if I'll be able to bingo tomorrow like I wanted to. Light blue. But we'll see. Yeah, I did I did decide to skip the movie review and I was writing a blog post. <laughs> I wrote out a blog post last night that I was going to uh post detailing, you know, like the mold situation and everything. And then I discovered the the new situation and now the post is like outdated. I might just I don't know. What's going on with my house? Uh There's mold in my kitchen cuz there was a leak. And so people are coming to... It's also in my living room because it, it leaked through the wall. And so people are coming to remediate the mold. Red. And then when the plumbers were here fixing the leak, they knocked a pipe loose and a bunch of dirty dishwasher and spoiled milk filled up uh, my downstairs closet which was I didn't mention before filled up that's I had filming equipment in there and luckily it didn't like splash up it just kind of like seeped out but it could have been it could have been Salmon. actually way worse um yeah everything's fine the carpet I think is stained I think I can get it out but like <laughs> Light green. I'm losing it over here just a little bit. Just a little bit. It'll be fine, though. I think it'll all be fine. Purple. 
How's MJ? She's fine. Uh, she's having to be se sequestered upstairs, so she's kind of stuck in one of two rooms. Um, I have been trying to, like, bring her downstairs when I can, but I think she's freaked out about what's happening, and she doesn't, Yellow. you know, when I come in to get her, she hides under the bed. So it just depends. When she gets hungry, she comes out and uh, we can we can bring her downstairs. How do you run Windows 98 games on modern hardware? I don't know. I don't know, Bob. This is this is uh, original hardware. Hot pink. Hot pink. Uh, but that's how that's how things are going over here. It's gonna be okay. Uh, it sounds like insurance is gonna cover. I mean, I still have a deductible and everything, but it sounds like they're going to cover most of it. Assuming they don't find, like, a fuck ton of mold yeah. in the walls. I just, I keep having these visions of them just, like, peeling the wall off. And they just keep finding mold, and they just keep peeling. They keep peeling. And then there's no walls. It's just me and, like, the roof. But maybe it'll be okay. Yeah. Is that orange? Learn. 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 Enunciate, child. Learn. Light yum, blue. Yum. Blue green. But if that is the first time you're hearing of my mold troubles, uh, that is my explanation. Crayon. And I apologize in advance uh, for any. Any time I don't, I'm not able to deliver on my promises. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try and get those vods up tomorrow. I really have to, cause I gotta do, I gotta get Bingo ninety eight vod up. Which movie were? Ah, I don't know if I want to. Oh, I, I don't know if I haven't decided if I'm gonna spoil it, because the movie review, um, I initially wasn't happy with it, so I rewrote it. Do you want to save your picture in the scrapbook? No. Um, I rewrote it and I really liked the script that I wrote. The problem is that it heavily revolved around my kitchen. And then like the next day, all this shit happened. So I might want to do it after the kitchen is re rebuilt. I don't really know. Phil. Uh, but it'll be, it'll be fine. I've, uh, oh, that's cool. Uh, it does present some opportunities in, uh, like, a, a video-making sense. It, it provides an interesting kitchen narrative. Oh, that doesn't look... That was an accident. <laughs> that was an accident. Light brown. I'm gonna be careful with, uh... <laughs> be careful with the, the black uh, Crayola here. <laughs> Yellow. Oh my god, the the shark is sharding. Green screen the kitchen. Listen, the shark was doing blackface, but it was a different time. <laughs> okay. White. White. Purple. Uh it was really just the red mouth that uh Hot pink. It would have looked like a shadow otherwise. Blue, green. Red. <laughs> the shark's yearbook. <laughs> yeah, that's camping foods. That's kind of the idea. You know, it's so weird because last month I was, uh, I really wanted to not do food. I was really over food. But it's so weird. Now that the kitchen is destroyed, I have all these food video ideas because suddenly I'm limited in what I can do and I, I see it all from like a different it's perspective so I mean I'm going to start working on a food video I've got a really good idea I think and then I also have another I've got another video I'm going to start uh, I'm going to film tomorrow that's not food but it, it could um, it Great. could bear fruit could bear fruit. And you know, if you don't if you don't make an effort to see 
the upsides of a shitty situation. It's just gonna be a shitty situation. Big crayon. Uh, but it could it could uh, could have some some upsides. What do you mean this coloring is terrifying? This coloring is perfect. Pattern brushes. Oh, I didn't even notice the pattern brushes. Yeah, let's go to a new one. In no. Sorry, I was just thinking about the mold. I wasn't looking around. Texture. Yeah, turn my misfortune into content. It's true. Yeah, the mold is getting to me. Texture. She can say texture just fine, but she can't say orange. Oh, cool texture. Yeah, if I do anything weird in the, the coming months, just blame it on the mold brain. I like that. Oh, this is cool. Actually, it kind of reminds me of mold now that I'm looking at it. I don't like this one anymore. It's reminding me of things. How about this one? This doesn't look like mold. Blame it on my twin. There we go. What's the you book? Save your picture in the scrap, but no. The Let's go to the... Okay. <laughs> Let's go to the library then. All right. Uh... Dinosaurs. You had 20 plus different symptoms after mold from a water leak. That sucks. We haven't noticed any symptoms here. Um, and I know that it's mold because I can see with my eyes that it's mold. But I'm still just like backdoor hoping they're going to come in and be like, there's no mold here. It's just uh, some black stuff. You know, there's black stuff on the walls sometimes, but it's fine. Oreo crumbs. You got a bunch of Oreos in here. Texture. These textures look like shit. Oh, it's so cool that it wraps it around like 3D, though. The texture looks awful, but I love that it colors the 3D modeling in there. This guy looks sick. From like breathing in the mold. My OC. Yellow. Yeah, this is my Dino Sona. This is this is how I envision myself. Big eraser. Oops. Uh. Big crayon. My mold Sona. <laughs> oh my God. Some of these songs, I'm like, oh my god, I know exactly what intro I used this song for. Red. Let's use the sky texture. Texture. See ya, Chaka. Thanks for hanging out. Always good to see ya. Ba, 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 ba. How do you guys feel about the, uh, well, we started like 11 a.m. for me? A little more morning, uh, bingo. I think ideally I would be starting right about now, but life is chaos currently. You can see why the dinos went extinct. Well, it's because they were all diseased. 
Weird to see it in the daytime. I do have a very like night focused theme. Um, but I mean, it carries over into the VOD. Like evenings. I, I am coming around to mornings more. Uh, but it's nice to change it up. I just feel like I can still do something. I, it's kind of like getting out of a movie. I don't like getting out of a movie when it's dark outside. Because I feel like the day is over. It's kind of the same thing when I stream. If I stream later, I, I get done and I'm like, oh, I guess... I guess I'll go lay down now. <laughs> I don't like that. Morning Brutal Foods. I think one was enough. I look like shit in that video. Well, I look like shit in a lot of my videos, though, so I guess that's not... <laughs> it's not exclusive. Light green. I'm gonna start looking like like trash on my uh, my streams too. I didn't even put on a shirt today. I just kind of showed up as I am. Tan. Tan. Mm -hmm. Blue. Blue. Muscle shirt and headband. What does that make me look like I'm about to do? I am West Coast. Best Coast. Mad Attack TV. Thank you for the $2. We have an update from our magic session. Our friend Ian was victorious in our last game. Your words of encouragement made him kick our butts. He is listening right now. Good job, Ian. I might not approve of how you, you spell your name because it's different than mine. But, uh... Keeping it, keeping it solid for the Ians. Your parents did this to you. Okay, well that's understandable. Ian in reality, but Ian in spirit, right? Don't call it out, Chunky Noodle. I'm far enough away to where you can't see my massive amounts of sweat. Damn it. Friend said you look like Brutal Moose. Who's that? I don't look like Brutal Moose. It's my twin, okay? That's offensive. You shouldn't go around saying that someone looks like someone because you, you never know when they could be an identical twin of that person and then would get very upset at the comparison. I demand apologies. <laughs> it's my fishing level? I don't remember. I think it's like 78 or something. I'm not sure. I'm going to start wrapping up, guys. How dare you think I look like my identical twin? Exactly. Exactly. I'm my own person, okay? Am I gonna print this? Absolutely not. I do it does I do want a printer at some point. Do you want to save your picture in the scrapbook? I'll save this one. It's in the scrapbook. Okay. Peach. Red. Rose, hot pink, pink, tan, peach, 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 orange, peach, orange, peach, red, peach, orange, peach, orange, hot pink, peach, orange, blue, light blue, blue green, green, light blue, light blue, green, 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 green. Green. Peach. Okay. <laughs> okay. I'll release you all. Do you really Green. Want to Goodbye. Bye. See you later. 
Now you won't. Well, I think that was a pretty successful session of bingo. Didn't hit it on the board, but some pretty decent games, I think. I will be back at some time. I don't know when. Uh, definitely not Monday. Outside of that, I'll see you when I see you. I'll see if I can be here tomorrow, but uh, I'm not totally sure. Um, I will get those VODs out, though. So thanks, everybody, for watching and for being patient with me as I navigate uh, the mold. Uh, next time I'm here, I'm here, I'll give you guys an update on it. As always, thanks, uh, thanks for watching. Tons of fun. And I really appreciate you guys uh, hanging out with me and, you know, help me get my mind off of some things. I will see you guys in hopefully just a few days. Well, maybe, yeah, hopefully just a few days. I'll, I'll put that out into the universe. Have a great rest of your weekend. And if I don't see you before then, uh, a very uh, relaxing 4th of July. All right. Bye, everybody. And now, folks, it's time to say good night. We sincerely appreciate your patronage and hope we've succeeded in bringing you an enjoyable evening of entertainment. Please drive home carefully and come back again soon. Good night. <laughs>